In this video, I'd like to go through some specific examples in terms of how we use those conversion factors to be able to go from grams to moles or moles per gram. So the first one I'm going to do is it asks for question number two, what is the molar mass of methane? Now technically, if I were just asked for the molar mass, I would write it as this, one mole of CH4 is equal to, now I have to go to the periodic table, C, there's one of them, and we're only going to the nearest tenth, so that's 12.0. H, there's four of them, and they're each worth one, so that gives me four. So that gives me a total mass of 16.0 grams of CH4. Now, because I know on this worksheet we are using all four conversion factors that we previously learned how to write. And those four conversion factors look like this, where we have a mole is equal to a certain number, which is equal to a certain mass, which is equal to a certain volume as long as you're a gas. And then we did set, work through several examples of how to do that. So technically, the molar mass is just this piece right here. But we also learned that a mole is a number, 6.02 e to the 23rd, and in this case we have to call them molecules of CH4. We also learn because CH4 methane is a gas, we also learned it's 22.4 liters of CH4. And I just ran out of room there, so I had to put the CH4 on the bottom. In the previous video, we learned how to convert, how to change from one unit into another. And we're going to learn how to use all four of these as conversion factors. So in question A, it asks how many moles of methane, CH4 is methane, are there in 3.01 e to the 23rd or times 10 to the 23rd molecules of methane? So we learned last time we're going to write down what's given. 3.01 e to the 23rd molecules of CH4. And we're going to multiply that by a conversion factor based off of these four statements. We learned that whatever units are listed here, we're going to put that conversion factor on the bottom. So if it says molecules, we're not going to put moles on the bottom. We're not going to put grams. We're not going to put liters. We're going to put 6.02 e to the 23rd molecules of CH4. Then... The, how we decide what goes on the top is based off of what's being asked. And since the moles are being asked, we're going to put one mole of CH4 on the top. Molecules cross out with molecules. CH4 crosses out with CH4. The ratio of 3.01 e to the 23rd divided by 6.02 e to the 23rd is a 1 to 2 ratio. So it's 1 times 1 divided by 2, so that comes out to 0 0.5 moles CH4 as our final answer. In question B, we are asked how many grams are there? Well, we've learned, we write down what's given, 3.02 3.01 e to the 23rd molecules of CH4. That's what's given to us. Then we multiply by a conversion factor. How do we decide which of the four conversion factors go on the bottom? Well, it just depends on the units that's here. Since it says molecules, we don't put mole, we don't put grams, we don't put liters, we put molecules. So once again, 6.02 e to the 23rd molecules of CH4. How do we decide which goes to the top? Well, it's what they're looking for. So since it says grams, we don't put moles, we don't put molecules, we've already used molecules, we don't put liters, we put grams. So we put 16.0 
grams of CH4. The molecules cross out. The, ro the ratio of 3.01 e to the 23rd to 6.02 is a 1 to 2 ratio. So now we have 1 multiplied by 16 is 16 divided by 2 gives me an answer of 8.0 grams of CH4. And then finally, what volume? So we write down what's given to us, 3.01 e to the 23rd molecules of CH4. We make an empty fraction. We're multiplying by an empty fraction. And because molecules are given to us, I'm going to put from the conversion factor, 6.02 e to the 23rd molecules of CH4. And because they're asking for volume from my conversion factor, I'm putting 22.4 liters of CH4. This worksheet specifically goes through how we use these four conversion factors. In the first example, we used moles on the top. Second example, we used grams on the top. Third example, we used volume on the top. And in each example, because we were given molecules, the term here for molecules went on the bottom. And now the ratio molecules of CH4 cross out with molecules of CH4. 3.01 e to the 23rd, e to the 23rd crosses out. 3.01 is half of 6.02. 1 multiplied by 22.4 divided by 2 is 11.2 liters of CH4. This was another example of setting up our four conversion factors and then an example of how we use each one of these conversion factors.